it's time to wake up, America. We are called to be born again. Jesus has made a call. If you want to enter the kingdom of God, you must be born again. Jesus has brought salvation. The kingdom of God is here. Jesus Christ has commanded us to be born again. Hey, what's up, guys? We are here in Washington right now, Washington, D.C. We're getting ready for the prayer march here that Franklin Graham has put together. As you can see behind me, we have a whole team here ready to go. This is part of the TLR group. And behind me, you see the, where is it at? There you go, the monument right there. We're going to start there and walk two miles. Just a prayer march. Just a prayer for God to come in America to wake the people up and that the people will hear the call of God for them to wake up, for them to realize that we need God in this nation. We need God in our lives. We need God to reform and transform the hearts so that this nation can can be a new creation, a new a newborn nation, if you will. Come back to the Word of God. And we have these shirts that says, Get America Born Again. Get America Born Again. We've lost, we've lost our, our fundamentals. We've lost our values. And so we just want to pray get together there's already been opposition there's a post that these uh luciferians and wiccans actually did their own march and proclaimed the state for lucifer but you know what greater is he that is with us than he that is in the world and so we just come in here proclaiming that god will move and uh with the short time that we do have he will make a move make an impact and it's gonna he's gonna use us use us who are willing to go out willing to go out and preach the gospel so enjoy this walk. I'll just try to capture as much as I can, but just want to let you guys know what we're doing. God bless you guys. Talk to you soon. Here in Washington, my brother. What's up, man? This is uh, it's been. Look at just look at all these people, guys. <laughs> look at all these people here. The one amazing thing about this is it does not matter the background, the denomination. You know what their their heart is set to one thing, and that's to pray for this nation. And we heard Franklin Graham talk. Um, many people actually came to spoke. The vice president spoke, and uh, there's one united prayer here is to get. America on a better track. Our message is to get America born again. And that's what I would tell you is you must be born again. You must be born again. Turn your hearts from your wicked ways to the living God. He can make a transformation in your heart. We spend too much time trying to change the world, but the reality is that our heart needs to change. And so America is great, but we just need to make America born again. As we move forward in this next season, Lord, we remember Psalm 68, verse 1, which says, 
Let God arise and his enemies be scattered. Let God arise and his enemies be scattered. Let God arise. Shout it with me on the count of three as a prayer to heaven that God will arise and anoint this leadership team, the vice president and the president. One, two, three. Let God arise. Amen. Be born again. Do you have any need of prayer? 